Hi, I'm Jerry Mikulski. The words ecology and economy, or economics, all come from the same root, which is oikos in Greek. And oikos is the house or the home or the household. And I was wondering recently why ecology and economics have ended up in our society as such opposites. Why are they so contrary? They're coming from the same thing, the management of the household. And one thing I ended up at is that I think that each of those, ecology and economy, has a very different idea of the size of the house. How big a household are we actually managing? In economics, it seems to be the physical house, me, my immediate family, me and mine, and if I just take care of me and mine and act as a rational individual and maximize our utility and our pleasure or whatever measure you think economics works on, everything in the large should work out. That seems to be the big act of faith in economics. In ecology, I think the house is the earth, or maybe larger, depending on your, your bent. But it's really a series of biospheres and biomes and watersheds and regions that interact and systems that provide services that we hardly even notice anymore, that we take for granted mostly. But ecology seems to be talking about a house that's much larger. And I think the interesting things that are happening right now are at the confluence of ecology and economics and many other disciplines, actually, because even those, when they're a little too scientific and too numeric, miss a lot of what else is going on in the world. But I think our house is really worth saving.